What's up, YouTube? This is Two Raw for Sports. So before I get into this video, I want to give a big shout out to the brother Robert Mason coming through once again. The man, the myth, the legend with the five dollar donation via the PayPal. All right. So much respect to the brother, uh, Mr. Mason, coming through once again, showing love to Two Raw for TV, aka Two Raw for Sports. All right, so I'm going to put a link to this article in the pinned comment in the comment section below. While the Boston Celtics have not come out and uh, have publicly announced who the woman is that Amea Doka allegedly had an affair with, um, or at least the initial woman, being that there are reports that there have been other women out there, but Daily Mail has outed the woman. The female employee is team service manager Kathleen Nemo Lynch. She's 34 years old, a married mother of three. The Celtics have not identified the woman Adoka was involved with, but Lynch's name has been leaked online. She serves as the team's liaison, arranging travel, lodging, and game tickets for Celtics family members at home and on the road, and is likely to have arranged travel for Adoka's fiance, actress Nia Long. A source familiar with the investigation told DailyMail.com that the affair was consensual, short-lived, and had ended by the time investigators got involved. Lynch has long-standing personal ties with the team's legendary former player, Danny Ainge, who was the team's executive director of basketball operations before leaving the franchise last year. Hmm. So now the wheels are beginning to turn in Two Raw's head as to who it was that actually leaked this information out there. Ainge, 63, a fellow devout Mormon, helped her land her job. So this is a woman who's a married mother of three and a devout Mormon? And she's the one that has the affair? And everyone's looking at Adoka, who reportedly has an alternative lifestyle? When I say alternative lifestyle, I mean as far as open relationship? A source familiar with the investigation told DailyMail.com that Ainge learned early in the summer that the Celtics had initiated an investigation into Odoka's relationship with Lynch, but he did not intervene in the investigation or decision to suspend the coach. The source added, however, that Ainge was deeply disappointed by the affair, especially given the facts that they have families. Hmm. Why does his opinion matter any fucking way? <laughs> oh, boy. Well, anyway. <clears throat> From looking at this article, I don't see any indication that she has been let go from the team. So, why has she not been punished? If that's the case. Maybe she did. We don't know about it. But there's no, there's no indication that she's been removed. She hasn't been suspended. Double standard. Then you, you know, when I say that sometimes women are treated like children when they make decisions, uh, that's what I'm talking about, you know? So at the end of the day, man, there's a lot of bullshit going on in my opinion, but tell me what you guys think about this. <clears throat> 